Alright, I hope this is a good angle. Um, just got a, uh, just got a, another part from my uh, local computer store. Pretty damn good deal on it. Don't know if you guys know it, but, um, the Gemini 2. Cooler Master. 50 bucks. Damn, that's a monster. Supposed to get about 30 degrees idle on this thing. Although, uh, my current temperatures are. My temperatures are right now 23 degrees Celsius on core zero and core one is 28 degrees Celsius idle so that's it that's I don't know if it, I don't know if it can beat that but we're gonna find out damn that's nice that's massive I didn't get the uh, 120 millimeter fans but I'm gonna get that tomorrow because my Christmas bonus comes in tomorrow so I'm gonna go back tomorrow and get two uh, 120 mils Right now I'm going to put this in just with stock, just put it in there, see how it runs with just no fans. Then tomorrow I'll put fans on it. That is nice. You get the uh, peel off label. Hope this video turns out good. I'll try to up convert this video to 720p. Wow, that is nice. Look at the curves on that. Six copper uh, heat pipes. Don't know if it's enough, but it should be good. That is elegant. That's beauty. Look at the fins. This is beautiful. Alright. See what we got in the box. You got mounting brackets. Uh, you got the uh, fan. I think these go on. The f these hold the fan in place. Frankly, I'm not sure how, but I'll figure it out. Let's get this out of here. I think I'll put my uh, Arctic Freezer Pro 7 on my Pentium 4. Oh, we got a little box here. There it is. That's all we get. Couple melting brackets for uh, AMD and Intel. I think this is the uh, AMD one. Oh, you get a uh, little thermal paste, but I won't be using that crap. Actually, I don't know. Let's find out if this is Arctic Silver 5. Doesn't say it. Looks like it is. Hold on, let me get my epic silver five. If I can find it. No, I don't know. I don't know where I put the damn thing. <laughs> Screws up. There's a. Uh, this is the one I'll probably be using. LGA775. I don't think it's. I don't think it, this can go on the uh, Core i7s. But then again, I'm not planning to get a Core i7 until next next fall. So, yeah.
Everything I got now is going towards a Core i7, an X58 motherboard. Last upgrade for this uh, for this rig. Alright, I'll try to get it in 720p so you can watch in high definition. If not, oh well.